Dragonflies spend most of their lives in fresh water in their larval nymph stage. They are formidable predators, catching prey at any opportunity with their hinged jaws, such as other insect larvae, including other dragonflies, snails and tadpoles and even small fish. The larval development typically takes one to two years, but does vary from species to species. The golden ring dragonfly, for example, can take more than five years. They will molt many times underwater until they are ready for their final molt. In some species, this is triggered by the day length, for example, but may also be the temperature of the water. The larvae may hang around in the shallow margins for a few days, getting ready to emerge and breathe air. They will look for emergent vegetation, such as the iris leaves and lily pads here in my wildlife ponds. Once they are firmly attached, they'll redistribute their body fluids and push out of their skin, and this is left behind and called an exuvia. It will take time for the newly molted dragonfly to expand and harden their wings, so they are often vulnerable at this stage to predation. Um, hard, harsh rainfall can also um, damage their soft tissues. Once they are ready, their maiden flight might only just be a few metres off into cover, but they'll soon be ready to head off, look for mates, lay their eggs and enjoy their last few weeks of life. We call this process incomplete metamorphosis because there's no cocoon phase like for butterflies and caterpillars.